November might mean colder temperatures and snow on the ground, but we're heating things up on this edition of Secret City as we celebrate 100 years of firefighting here at the Firefighters Museum of Calgary. Joining me inside the museum is two retired firemen who now volunteer their time here, Brian and Gary. So Brian, the museum itself has been around since 1985, but the space that we're in now has actually only been around since June. So tell us a little bit about it. Well, we were allotted this space when the new building was being constructed, and it's, it's a really a nice space. We've got some phenomenal artifacts on display. And a few of those artifacts that you're pointing out are the lockers behind us that recognize some of the fallen firemen, and also the mural painted by local artist Mandy Stobo. So tell us a little bit about her inspiration for that piece. The first Monday of every month, we have coffee here at the museum for the retirees. And Mandy was here and she she just got her paintbrushes out and started painting this uh, phenomenal wall over here with stories as the guys talked about things that happened uh, while they were on the floor and there's other things on there about the older history of the fire department, little odds and ends and goofy things that used to happen on the, on the fire department. And Gary, where do a lot of the artifacts come from in the museum? A lot of the artifacts in the museum here have been donated by retired firefighters, retired firefighters' families who maybe have passed away and we go through it, make sure that we don't already have 10 or 20 of them, and then we'll take them and put them into our display areas. Do you have a pretty big collection at home? Not anymore, a lot of it's in here now. <laughs> What's one piece that you've donated that we can see here? Uh, there's two little fire helmets around here with a red light on the top that came out 20 years ago. I brought two of them in here so the kids can wear them and they have a siren and a red light on the top and those kind of things. I think it's really neat that you guys take time to come down and engage with the community. Why was that so important for you? Well, we have so many unique artifacts uh, going back to the First World War uh, firefighters that left the fire department, went to war, and came back. And we have some phenomenal artifacts that uh, portray their uh, their journey. And uh, it's just one of these type of museums that there's so many little things that you can look at and you have no idea what they are, what they were about, but when you find out about them, they're quite awesome in their own right. Why do you think it's important for people to come out and walk around the museum and have a, have a talk with you guys? Because most people don't know the history of the Calgary Fire Department. Uh, we're over a hundred years in the city of Calgary as a paid department and uh, the stuff we have in here starts at the beginning and comes right up to today. So we can take them through and show them what it used to be like, uh, tell some stories and lies, have a lot of fun and people really enjoy it. For more information and links to the Firefighters Museum of Calgary, just head to our website, breakfasttelevision.ca.